Good evening and welcome to the community. I'm Rilovetch and today we're going to be playing Pal World. As the owner of the Pokemon distributor company, The Card Hoarder, I am overly qualified for this game. This is my first playthrough series on YouTube, so like and sub if you want to keep them coming. First things first, loading into the world and making my character. Every other YouTuber has probably shown you this already, so we're just going to fast forward through this part. I don't know if there is a story mode to it. Honestly, I have no clue what's going on yet. I saw like level 31s and stuff, and I saw some top streamers with that in their titles, so that might be what it is. Once we got our character looking crispy, we head into our journey to find a spot for home base. I will be commentating over this playthrough to give more context and details. If you want to tune in live, it's at Rilovetch on kick. After punching a rock, punching a tree, building a wood bench, and figuring out I could upgrade my stats, I was well on my way to success and I could feel it in my heart. We beat down our workbench so nobody else could use it, punched the tree a few more times, and made our way down the cliff. I will say it is a slower start of a game, but whenever you're enjoying what you're doing, that isn't really a problem. Yeah, that'll do the trick. A dungeon? What is that? Look at that. Food was scarce and nightfall was close. I had to attack this chicken in fear that it would spawn tons of other chickens out of nowhere and kill me. What's that timer? Is that before it like spoils or something? Oh, I got coffee. Oh, yeah, I'm just chilling, vibing, enjoying this game. Dude, there's so many streams live. And everybody got, like, good viewers, but nobody got too many viewers. It's really impressive of a category right now. Dude, if I had to Google how to craft this little sphere thing... Alright, I think I'm gonna make a little home here on this beach and go, uh... Destroy this boss eventually and move on after I do that. So let's go ahead and do a little workbench over here. Hopefully, like, a bunch of critters don't come out at night or nothing. I saw this in an art... No, this was on Twitter, I think. In only eight hours. Oh, you meant a million. You just forgot a zero. My bad. Yeah, you're good. Oh, it, I found the cube. Gotta get this torch so I don't die. It's the middle of the night. Oh, yeah, it's already lit. Look at that. Like, we need some more rock. Even if y'all's just chilling. Thank you so much. I never thought we'd be able to play a game and stream, but this one might be it. All the other games are dead and all worn down. Really need a rock. Yeah. Now I can go craft some Pokeballs and catch these guys. And then hopefully they fight for me and do something. Let me get some of these Pokeballs. I can still only get one after all that work. If What if it don't uh, capture it? Let me, uh, get a, a club, too. Look at that. I see something moving up there, which might be a problem. I don't like it. And I kind of want one of those. Okay. After realizing we were hungry, we decided to walk over here and murder these two chickens with fire. And then finally, after all that time... It was finally time to catch our first pal mon thing. And where's my like hunger bar at? Oh, it's down there at the bottom, I see.
It was in fact, not time. That's really convenient. On our way to find our body, we saw another cat and had to punch it out of rage. The situation got out of hand, so we jumped off this cliff to safety. But then we learned that stamina indeed does not last forever. Who is this? A soul. That's usually how it is with games, but I get so deep into them also. Now where's my home at? Oh, down there on the beach. Okay. How did this get up here? Whoa, look at that thing. The dinosaur looking thing. Can I? No, I can't catch that one now, but I'm, I'm gonna catch that. After being beat down by cats, we decided to recruit a sheep to the team. Alright. Now. Okay. I guess that's what we're gonna use that guy for. <laughs> I figured he had some attack value or something, but no. No, uh. After deeming the sheep useless, it was time to see how he performed in battle, and I was not displeased at all. We managed to catch a chicken and add it to the team. Alright, we gotta go back to the beach. I think that's where I was, like, setting up my home at. Look at that. That's a Torterra. That's a starter Pokemon, third evolution. I've seen it before. Alright, cool, cool. Back, back down here. I need a pickaxe. Gotta get that work put in. Oh, wow, we got enough stone. A stone axe. Wow. Do we have 11 points? Is that what that means? Because that feels like I have way too many than I should have. Oh, I need that to respawn my homie. And then... They're really making me go from a bow to an AK-47. Like, that is crazy. Alright, I think you just start... Yeah, I think you just get it all. A bow would come in handy. Yeah, I got it on Steam. It costs $30, though. And if you got Xbox, I hear it's free. With the Xbox Pass. Oh, and I'm using an Xbox controller. Honestly, it wouldn't be a bad game for mouse and keyboard, but I just, I don't know. I, when I was a kid growing up, we used the Xbox controller, so I'm just more comfortable with it. Yeah, I had to get it. I got it a day late. I wish I would have got it a day earlier. I would have already been playing it. I, I When I, I saw some other people playing it, I didn't realize it had just came out. That's a good game right there for streaming. We got so much wood. Oh, it's daytime finally. Good, good. I really want one of those. Oh, it's not even a fish. I thought it was a fish. It's level 7, though. It'll it'll ruin me if I attack it. You might just be able to hit this mountainside and get some. I'm not really too sure. Let's see. No, no. It ain't that simple. The, those are the rocks you can hit right there. I haven't seen any mobs that are aggressive unless you attack them either, which is nice. But see these rocks right here? Yeah, we got plenty of stone. Before you get a pickaxe, it's not worth it to do this at all. Lesson learned. Dude, but I'm talking like machine guns. I, I Just from the trailers of what I've seen, this game gets crazy. Boss fights, raids, they got it all. You're weighed down for carrying too much stuff. So is that what the stat weight, the weight for stat does? Oh, I wasn't increasing weight because I thought you was just getting bigger so the enemies didn't knock you as far. I wonder what's the longest time that this could take. Like, you know, that just says five seconds. I wonder if they have, like, hour ones and stuff. They're really making you Minecraft it out. I love it. I've been texting all the old homies, like, come on, hop on this. So hard to find time to spend with people. But a good game might be the trick. <laughs> oh, that aim assist is, like, crazy. I cannot believe, like, it is pulling me to that. Which, I mean, is nice. It's not really about the combat. But wow. 
You saw that? I went over it. Look at that jerk. I ain't got no hacks on. I'm bobbing and weaving in a jerks like that. It like holds it on it. I'm like giving it a little resistance there. Alright, we need food or we're gonna die. Let's go find some chickens. The lamb ball's dead. I don't know how to revive them, yeah. but I do got this one chicken. Yeah, once I get subscribers and funding, I usually burn most of everything I make into giveaways and giving it back. It just ain't about the money for me, more about the experience. Why are there no chickens to eat? I don't understand. I need to go farther just to find food. Yeah, Mini May, we do a lot of giveaways whenever we're gambling on the gambling side of the content. But we also... Ooh, there's a chest over there. But we also... Uh, once we get subs, we'll just do them casually. I've done so many on whatnot, it's ridiculous. We're also going to have a... Ooh, a Mega Spear, what is that? This is brutal. Alright. How do you kill it? <laughs> oh, man. Oh, look. We got some bread. We were really jumping to conclusions there, huh? <laughs> Where did that bread even come from? Whatever, whatever. We're, so, we're good. That, me and that chicken, we got it. We're good. <laughs> oh, that's probably where the bed came from. That last chest. Not bad call at all. Doing a little bit of scavenging early. Which I was scared to do. I thought I'd just die, but there's nothing out here. Oh, this is where you respawn from. What does this do? Wow, I've walked past that so many times and never done that. I'm telling you, I'm gonna make some good, helpful videos for people. I wonder if this chick has anything for me. She did earlier. <laughs> if you don't stop walking with the controller and you talk, it just keeps going. I don't know if y'all saw that. Oh, here's chicken. We really do need some more of that. All right, we good. Yeah. They level up too, which I think is super cool. I'm about to go mass produce pals. I don't know if there's a need for that. Build a little bit. There's so much to do. It's so interesting. Ooh, look, another chest. Those things got the goods in them. What am I supposed to do with gold coins? Oh, there is a black market, I think. I've heard of this. I try not to find too many spoilers online and avoid them. I got one ball. Please don't throw it. How do you cancel a left trigger? Alright, good. You accidentally throw those and it is absolutely miserable. I think I should get the, one of them cat things now. Those cats are really good. I got the swipe attack. And I already got one of him, but he's just dead. <laughs> Alright, we gotta grab one and go back to base. Look at that tower. I'm gonna explore that. I don't know anything about that. Everybody's sleeping. This bad boy's off here, over here, so low. Oh, wow. I did not expect that much damage. Alright, that's good. What Palmon will Rillavetch catch with his Pow Ball? Will Rillavetch ever find his way home? Will Rillavetch turn a bow into an AK-47? Find out next time on episode 2 of Pow World.